point of this whole thing is that a lot of people, they think that it's some type of special skills that you need to do this game. Oh, no, she set off on its own. Uh, but I will say what you do need is you need commitment and consistency to keep going. And I told this one bro, I met this one bro out here when I was doing my rounds, relaxing, you know, meeting women. Um, and he was like, man, what should I do? What should I do? He's asking me those questions. I said, look, I could give you all this advice and I'll take him around with meeting women, but you gotta keep doing this, man. You can't just stop. Like one day, you had a great day, fine. But this stuff is consistently, you know, for your whole life. You have to keep talking to people. And not keep just working. women. Just keep, keep talking to women. The clock. You gotta keep punching the clock. Every day, don't stop. Keep working. Every day. Keep Bill, trying to Bill get Gates, that money. Steve Jobs, why are they billionaires? You think they just stopped writing software one day? Did Steve Jobs, you know, did he just stop going to work? Because he made like a few multi-millionaires? No, he kept going. Now he got the iPod, the iTunes. You know, Bill Gates, did he, he stopped, he caught the antitrust lawsuit. You know, he could have stopped writing software, he could have stopped doing Microsoft, but he kept on going, got the Xbox 360. You know, these guys are consistent, and they know what they want, and they keep going every day. So if you're going to be, you know, a player or a prostitute or whatever you're going to be, or whatever you want to be in the world, you just got to keep doing it. Like, this has to be your life. You have to live the life. You got to make that money and yeah. make that money work for you. got to make it work, yeah. Make that money work for you, because nowadays, Nowadays, you know, sure we, you know, white men fucked us over, slaving us, slaving the world, and everything. Yeah. And the reason they did it was because they were going poor by the second the country was poor. Yeah. And they weren't, they weren't enjoying the luxuries that was going on in Africa and in China and yeah. in the Asia and stuff at those times. And they were just poor. They, they didn't trust their own people. The people didn't trust them. So they went out there conquering, destroying everything. But now, everything's so invested, you know, and it's hard to make that money. So yeah. what do they do? They say, well, hey, let's generate. Let's generate ways to find a way where we can make more money because the government's taking too much and the smart people say we don't want to pay the government. So they're doing ways to uh, stock things come up and you can make money. I mean, you can get a million dollars yeah. and that's fine. But what would you do with a million dollars in America? You can't live. For the rest of your life nope. on that money. Not if you don't know how to. That ain't gonna last, yo. It ain't gonna last. Because as long as the cup is being drained and ain't getting filled, it's gonna run out. Yeah. Unless you're with a Thailand and these other countries <laughs> yeah. and stuff. And, and hey, that's. That's an option. That's not a bad idea. Cause you know, Thailand is nice. Fine women. I mean, <laughs> yeah. I used to thought, I, I used to think that. Had a lot of fine women. Uh, Asia. Oh God, man! They blow and these chicks like, out oh the waters. Goodness, and they look, you know, I mean, they got, you know, they look different, blacks, and they look like yeah. whites and stuff. But, and they, the whole attitude is just so, yeah, so, that, so, so different. Yeah. You know, and, and all you brothers out there that might be listening to this, and sisters out there, you know, you guys get on that yeah. business trip. You know, you say you don't like math. I can't handle the math. But we created. <laughs> we made that. We taught them. We taught them everything. So how can you say you can't do it? Yeah. You know, maybe they're not teaching you right. But all it is, adding is what? Adding and subtracting. Yeah. Division is just a quicker way of subtracting the same number. Multiplication is just a quicker way of adding the same number. You know, and all this, these things, you know, you look at life. So, get off that trip where you say you can't do nothing. Yeah. Right, start educating yourselves. You know, it's out there. Oh, and another thing too. Another just gets off the subject. But just gets. Uh, so I don't forget. White people don't like us as a whole, but they love us individually. Yeah. That's how we can win. Go to them one by one. You go to them as one person. And they will love you and they give you all the information you need. Take that information, go back to their pay, give it, teach it to who we need, to those that listen. Those that don't want to listen, don't worry. Everybody ain't going to heaven. <laughs> it ain't nowhere in the Bible where it says God loves you. Yeah. It's, it's written where God regretted making man and seeing how <laughs> sinful we are and he gonna send those that, that don't do what he say to hell and all that stuff. It ain't nowhere. It ain't nowhere in the Bible. God says he loves us. Yeah. Even what Jesus says he loves us. It's nowhere written. So don't yeah. worry about it. You know. 
one of all them people that, that don't want to listen to you probably help on anyway. So, <laughs> so they're doing you a favor. Yeah. You know, so just just get out there, do what you can, help your people, those that don't listen. I mean, because even me and Ron, we got our own little story when I first met him. <laughs> you know, you know, we, 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 it wasn't smooth. Yeah. You know, he was just young. You know, and, and I just had to wait because sometimes people are not going to understand. It takes time. Yeah. You know, sometimes it just takes it's time. It's like the Google guys. Awesome. You know, when the um, when the Google guys first met, they didn't like each other. Yeah, yeah. They thought, one of them thought the other was arrogant. The other thought the other one was pretentious or something like that. But the more they talked, the more they started growing each other. And they liked the fact that they argued, but they still come to an agreement. So when you meet somebody like that, and uh, meet someone like Ralph or somebody even, some of my boys in the States, we have arguments, like almost ready to fight arguments, but why are we still boys? Because, you know, we have something about us that just shows a respect for someone who can voice their opinion and, and someone who can get to voice <laughs> Well, probably sleep in this shit. Yeah, Starbucks. Yeah, and someone, you know, but, um, just linking up with people and forming teams instead of trying to do the whole thing like, you know, Americans love that whole American dream, lone gunman, the lone hero yeah. myth. It's not true. It never was true. It's crazy, never will actually. Be true. It's 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 people, even in Japan. People think that stuff's insane. You know, trying to do everything by yourself, you can never get anything accomplished. But if you hook up with a team, and you know, you might disagree, you might. You know, things might happen, you might be angry. But yeah, let's roll out. Okay. There you go. Yeah, okay, okay, let's roll out. Yeah, because right. my car's sitting but out anyway, in the front. Anyway, to, to close it down, this is just the beginning. We're going to have some more stuff for y'all. We're going to hit the streets. We're going to hit different places. We're going to go and show y'all exactly what we're talking about. Just think of it like a documentary. <laughs> yeah, really. All right. Yeah. Mm -hmm.